What's going on everyone, it's your boy Nelly here. I've been seeing a lot of rumors and speculation circulating online about the relationship between my mom and Ashanti, and I feel like it's time to set the record straight. Now a lot of you may know that Ashanti and I had a high-profile relationship back in the early 2000s. We were that it couple for a while there, you know what I'm saying? But what a lot of people don't know is the behind-the-scenes drama that was going on with my family. My mom, Miss Lavish, has always been a very strong-willed and opinionated woman, and she did not approve of my relationship with Ashanti at all. In fact, she went out of her way to make Ashanti's life difficult whenever she was around. A lot of people have been wondering, why did Nelly's mom hate Ashanti so much? Well, today I'm going to give you the full story. I'm going to pull back the curtain and let you in on what was really going on. This is me, Nelly, setting the record straight. It all started back when Ashanti and I first got together in the early 2000s. I was on top of the world, you know? I had just blown up with hits like Hot in Who and Dilemma, and I was living the dream. And then I met Ashanti, and we just clicked. My mom met Ashanti for the first time at one of my album release parties, and let's just say the vibe was a little tense. From the moment they laid eyes on each other, you could cut the tension with a knife. My mom was giving Ashanti the stink eye all night long, and she wouldn't even make an effort to be friendly or welcoming. I remember pulling my mom aside and being like, Ma, what's going on? Why are you being so cold to Ashanti? And she just looked at me and said, I don't trust her, Nelly. I think she's after your money and your fame. She's not good enough for my son. I was honestly shocked. I had no idea my mom felt that way. Ashanti was the sweetest, most down-to-earth girl I had ever met. And I truly believed that she loved me for who I was, not for my success or my bank account. But my mom wasn't having it, over the next few years, every time Ashanti would come around, my mom would find a way to start drama. She'd make snide comments, she'd roll her eyes, she'd even straight up ignore Ashanti completely. It got to the point where Ashanti dreaded coming around my family because she knew she was just gonna get the cold shoulder from my mom, and you know, I tried to talk to my mom about it. I'd say, Ma, can you please just give Ashanti a chance? She's a good person, I promise. But my mom was stubborn as hell. She refused to budge, no matter what I said. Eventually, the constant tension and drama took its toll on me and Ashanti's relationship. We ended up breaking up, and a big part of that was the issues we were having with my mom. Ashanti just couldn't take it anymore, and I don't blame her now, I know a lot of people have been speculating about the real reason why my mom didn't like Ashanti. Some people have even said that it was because Ashanti is a black woman, and my mom is more comfortable with other races. But I'm here to tell you that that's not the case at all. My mom has always been proud of her African American heritage, and she's never had a problem with black women. The real reason she didn't like Ashanti was simply because she didn't think Ashanti was good enough for me. She had this vision in her head of the perfect woman for her son, and Ashanti just didn't fit that mold. Look, I'm not saying my mom is a bad person. She's always had my best interests at heart, and she's always looked out for me. But in this case, I think she was just being overly protective and judgmental. She didn't give Ashanti a fair chance, and that's something I've always regretted. So there you have it, straight from the horse's mouth. That's the real story behind the tension between my mom and Ashanti. I hope this clears things up once and for all. And to Ashanti, if you're watching this, I want you to know that I'm sorry for the way my mom treated you. You didn't deserve that, and I hope you can forgive me, alright, that's all I got for you today, fam. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.